Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. So the point is that, that's why I'm talking is that we need to to seriously look at the UPND rigging, the rigging machinery of UPND. We need to look at it very seriously. Don't take this one as the, just me uh, politicking. No, it is a serious, serious issue. UPND, they are master riggers. And they were rigging even when they were in power. They were rigging. In Southern Province, you tell me who was going there in Southern Province to monitor elections. Eh? Who? They were doing, you couldn't do anything. Elonga mwati mwone, ku Southern Province, ku Kusaiduku, bali ipanga face like it's one part, the other side. Bali putura kachalo ba UPND, ku Kusaiduku, ni UPND and it's one party state. It's one party state there. Eh? Bali, bali fikosha fie. So, we need to be wary of the UPND machinery in rigging. And they have not started now. They were rigging even when they were in opposition. Now you can imagine they are in power. They are controlling everything. You can imagine that. It's going to be very difficult to get power from the UPND because of their rigging. Eh? It's very, very difficult. But nonetheless, our God is a God who loves us all. Our God, we are, we are God's children. So no matter what Baaka in the HDMI try to do, his time will come. So no matter what ba, no matter what Baaka in the HDMI tries to do, his time will also come. His time of uh, being humbled will come. I have no doubt Baaka in the HDMI Time will come for him to be humbled together with he, uh, his team. Because now I say they chalo kwati, chalo chavo. You know, they feel they can do anything. These elections which are coming, don't expect anything. UPND are busy just distributing according to what they want. They are giving political parties, they choose which political party should be first, which political party should be second, which political party should be third, they are the ones choosing. They are rigging these elections. No doubt about it. I have no doubt. And they are perfecting their skills of rigging. They were doing it when they are in opposition. Now that they are in power, they are doing it even more and they are perfecting the art of rigging. It is worse because they are controlling the system. President Daka in the HDMI is the one who has appointed. Look at ECZ. ECZ has been turned you know from inside out it has been turned from inside out the people that are there now we have cadres we have cadres for UPND starting with the chairperson of ECZ Bamling Mwangala Zalomes I mean you are UPND who doesn't know it is not a secret she's a UPND she's one of those people that fought she was even the uh, you know, part of the team. Eh? Zalomes is she's a UPND proper, proper. So, honestly, how do you expect Pamangala Zalomes to run a free and fair election in Zambia? A person who is a, a, a UPND cadre, how do you expect her to run the, ele the elections? Then you have, you know, a, a very active man there, a very active man. He's Chipenzi is, is my good friend, and he, I will never forget for him. Uh, he came and signed, he saved me, he signed a uh, bond for me, Chipenzi. I will never forget. So, my, my friend Chipenzi, 
please don't take this personal. It is uh, uh, just me doing politics, and I need to say this. So uh, don't say, ah, this man, I helped him, and now look what he's talking. No, I'm talking about you, my brother, as a UPND. And I mean, let's face it, you know it. Eh? UPND, Chipenzi is a UPND, and Chipenzi is the architect, is the expert on, on those commissioners, those commissioners, the ECZ commissioners. Chipenzi is the expert, he's an election expert. He knows how to rig elections, Chipenzi. He knows how to deliver. If he wants, he can deliver a free and fair election. But in this case, how can he deliver free and fair, free and fair elections? when his party is, is, is a contestant. He can't. He can't. There is no way. Then you, you go inside. I mean, ECZ Yari Chinja. Yari Chinja ECZ. Eh? We, we even failed to go there. Eh? We could, those days you could go there and whatever, whatever. We would go there and quarrel with the, the people at ECZ. This time around, who are you going to quarrel with? Who are you going to quarrel with? Because it is like a department of the UPND. Other political parties will find it very difficult to go in that, uh, uh, in that institution. It has become, you know, e, e, you know inherently, you know, hostile. You know, you just, when you just go there, the aura that you get, you just get that feeling, the UPND feeling, when you go to ECZ. Eh? Because there are cadres there. Even when they operate, we don't have professionalism. We don't have professionalism. You have to be a cadre to, be, to work for ECZ. Even she, it's Yari Chinja fear. Yari Chinja. It is a UPND special branch. ECZ is a UPND special branch. And they are there to make sure that they deliver elections according to the way UPND wants it, particularly the way President Haka Inde Ichinima wants it. So these elections which are coming, me, I'm not even bothered. I'm not even bothered. And political parties, you know, some political parties, like somebody was saying, no, uh, you know, uh, Socialist Party is doing very well, whatever, whatever. I don't believe, not that, not that they are not doing well, they are doing well, but they are putting them where they want them to be. They are putting them where they want to, them to be. So, you can't expect a free and fair elections from ECZ because the people in ECZ are you PND? And if we are going to have a free and fair election, because you like to say, no, what is the solution? From my point of view, it is high time that political parties start, uh, start looking into the issue of changing the people in ECZ to depoliticize ECZ. I mean, I don't know how it can be done, but we need to start discussing ECZ. We cannot go into 2026 general elections with cadres uh, like Mwangala Zalomes to be the chairperson. We need somebody that can be neutral, somebody that can give confidence to other political parties. These are my suggestions. Let us start talking ECZ. We don't need Mwangala Zalomes there. We don't need Chipenzi there. We don't need the exact other man. You know, uh, I've forgotten his name. We don't need those. We need to change ECZ. We need to change ECZ. Even that director that they that they that they brought. I mean, he has turned out to be a, a a UPND sympathizer. We don't need that legal team. That legal team. Those people who came up and said no, a, a, you know, Boma Nusambo and Malange cannot contest. We need to remove those. They participated. I'm giving you examples of how ECZ is compromised. Clearly, they are compromised, for example, when they refused. When they, first of all, they issued a statement. They issued a statement. Afterwards, they even refused to accept the nominations of uh, Joe Malangi and, uh, and Boma Nusam. They also did the, uh, the same thing in, 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 in other, other areas. So we can't trust those people. We need... We need people 
that at least we can have confidence. I don't know how we are going to do it, but when we start talking about it, there is a way. This discussion that we are kind of is talking about that we should talk and whatever, whatever. These are some of the things that we should be bringing on the table. That we need an ECZ that reflects some independency, that reflects some impartiality. That's what we need. That's what we need. We cannot uh, go for an election and we, when we have those people there, no, 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 no. Those people, no, no. We need, we need people that are impartial, people that are political. Yes, everyone in Zambia has to vote and they vote in a certain direction. But at least we should be able to see, we should be able to have some confidence in them. Not a Makada has ever come to the Turani elections. No, no. So, in every area, she made a terrible Let us start looking at ECZ and start making proposals to change ECZ. Because ECZ cannot deliver a free and fair elections. Those are chief riggers for the UPND. That is my, that is my, 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 my statement. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. Alright, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.